What's going on y'all? We got a good one today. We are actually headed to the Guggen HQ to pick up some new kayaks, man. Brand new 2020 colors of Bonafide kayaks. You've seen me fish out of kayaks a lot, probably even in some of the recent videos. Anytime you guys see those kayaks in these videos, it's because I'm borrowing them from the Guggens, but no longer are we gonna have to do that because we've got a fresh set coming from Bonafide for Devin and I, and I'm pretty eager to show you guys these things. So stick around until we get to the warehouse. We're actually meeting the delivery driver there and gonna get these things fresh off off the trailer man let's go ahead and get there and show you these new toys man i'm excited so here's the ones i've been borrowing we actually went out and took them fishing today uh four hours got skunked and now i'm a little hungry so i grabbed me some lunch bowls we're about to get over to the hq and grab these things pulling up it looks like there's some other crew members here as well all right we in the building let's get these things unlocked first of all they ain't biting today or have you been out no, I wasn't on. I went on the fit for a little bit. Yeah, it's uh... It was pretty slow, honestly. Right. Caught like two good ones, but I'm not sure that it was pretty, pretty dust. Maine's all locked up, but they still love fishing. Same with Florida right now. Okay. So it's still fish, allowed fishing. Fishing is yeah. allowed, but it's yeah. like they're closing out boat ramps yeah. and this yeah. and that and this. Yeah, I feel like they're going to close a lot of these ramps and stuff. But... All right, y'all, we got the other yaks put up. Here comes the new shipment, man. Look at this trailer. All right, let's see what's in here. At one point he said 54 boats. They could fall out, we'll see. All right, things are looking pretty good. All right, how can I help you? This one's a little bit in the way. We gotta grab this blue tape right here, get the old yeller. Here we go, we got the venom, baby. Oh yeah, wait till we get that thing unpackaged. So clean. This is the endless summer color right here. Dude, she just unveiled. Look at this color, endless summer. Look, that's my sh dang. She's gonna be pissed. I already got this thing dirty. All right, and then we got a seat to load up, and then also we got the venom color. Check this thing out, dude. This one's mine right here. Look at this highlighter yellow. Woo! The fish gonna see me coming from a mile away. Let me get this thing unwrapped, and then we're gonna load these things up in the trailer and probably take them out this evening. So stick around for that. Jay's on his way out. Look at this thing out of the box. Ooh, too clean. You gotta take him out right now? I might. I'm gonna hit Devin up and see if she's she wants right now. Oh man, all right, before we head out of here, y'all, we're gonna try and grab us a little apparel. <laughs> like a, a small or a medium would probably do, so I'm just gonna... Okay, we ran back inside with Grant and got a bunch of goodies. I'm gonna head back home and uh, show you guys exactly what all we got, and also we may potentially get back out on the water. We got a couple hours until sunset, I think. I've lost track of time, but anyways, we might do some more fishing, you guys. Stick around, catch y'all in a minute. Dang y'all, this place is packed. I've literally never seen more than like one or two cars in this parking lot, but we kind of got the last spot. In fact, we're taking up kind of two. And we're gonna try and actually put one of these in the water. I'm pretty eager to get uh, to test these things out for you guys. First impressions of the new color schemes. And it's literally 45 minutes before sunset, so I'm just gonna put a couple accessories on here, lock up baby blue, and we will go ahead and get to fishing for a minute before we take you guys back to the casa. It's pretty dang windy. I think 18 miles an hour wind speeds earlier. And so we're gonna be getting pushed around on the kayak, but I don't don't mind too much. Uh, we have those little anchors, so we'll see what happens. All right, we got the boat down by the water. We're in some of the new apparel, baby bandito bug. And now uh, we're gonna launch this thing for the first time. Maiden voyage right here. We didn't even put the front handle on. Check this. Here's the uh, here's the front handle. So made my life a little bit more difficult because I was pulling it down without the handle. But yeah, get the thing in the water, try and catch a fish. Okay, we are on the Venom, y'all, and we are about to launch. This should be fun. This is the last time you're ever going to see it clean. Look, it's already getting dirty, so we'll see what happens, man. We are just going to cruise the bank. It is not as clear as the last few times I have fished it, so uh, I don't know how this drop shot's going to go, but that's what I've got tied on. 
that black and blue jig I have tied on could work pretty well. And I've also got a swim bait and then something else. I don't even remember. Let's see if I can't get a little fishy. Got one. There we go. All right. First one on the yak. Yes, breaking in the bona fide, and he's flying for us. Cool. Sick, right there on the bank. There we go. Got it. First fish on the new yak, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Drop shot, getting it done. Ooh, he is flopping too. Sweet. All right, y'all. Breaking in the new kayak. Just right. Venom yellow, brand new red hoodie. We're having fun out here, you guys. Thank goodness, too, because I've been fishing all day with Bryce and Christian. Haven't caught nothing. So this little guy feels pretty dang good. Came on the drop shot, Sunset Bug, Guggen Baits Dragon Drop. And I don't know what's going on, but my anchor is not coming undone. I'm going to dip this fish back in the water for a second. The anchor is literally stuck like i don't know what i'm gonna do except i don't know what i'm gonna be able to do except literally cut the rope because i tried to yank this anchor out it's not just stuck in grass like i think i'm on a cable of something i don't even know so anyways anchor's a problem and there's about 20 more minutes of sunlight probably so i need to figure that out but i also want to catch more fish now that i realize i believe they're up shallow and the dragon drop's gonna get it done sick all right guys unfortunately he threw my bug and all those jumps so my sunset bug it's not a uh, bandito bug it's a drop shot but i am having to rig up a new dragon drop now and this is uh potentially natural i think this is a natural and what i had on was again sunset bug not to repeat myself a hundred times but yeah right up there in the shallows man literally didn't even work it because i know i'm gonna be popping through this grass i just pretty much let it sit and the fish came to it so that was cool Okay, sunlight is fading. We are switching things up to a weightless Sanko. We're going to cinnamon lunker log. Yep, yep, yep. Text pose hook, no weight. Should be able to sift through this grass or stay above it. That's what I'm talking about. Now we're in good shape. Right on the bank. Try something different before we have to leave here. Not much light left. Yeah, I, actually, I just got it today. This, this is one of their new ones, man. I'm stoked on this little color. It's going to get dirty quick, that's for sure. Yeah, I feel like an idiot. I don't know. You can try and pull this thing, but I think it's... Oh, no, you was... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, watch your YouTube, bro. <laughs> appreciate you. Yeah, no doubt, man. What's your name? Edgar, man. Edgar, nice to meet you. Did you, did you fish out here often or not? I've definitely fished here, but I haven't caught anything big like I've heard some of my friends pull out recently. Dude, so I was dude, like, you know what? I got to get back here. A... Oh, dude, that is like slugs. Man. That's what I, that's what I thought. <laughs> that's what I thought. I was just, I mean, I have, I have some cutters that go through braid and everything, so I figured I'd just give these a... Oh, here, you said you just want to call it and say... I think I'm going to have to. Okay. Yeah, I can't, I don't think I'm going to save it, so, yeah, I appreciate you. <laughs> uh, I think we're on lockdown tomorrow, for, for real, for real, so I don't know if we'll be able to break out the axe anymore. I'm going to see what happens. And now out of nowhere, we're back home in the garage. I didn't explain that very well, but basically what had happened was uh, it was sunset. There was pretty much no light left, and I was like, okay, I got to um, figure out this anchor situation. Thankfully, Edgar was right there and happened to have a pair of scissors on his kayak, and I was all embarrassed. I'm like, dude, I need some help. My freaking anchor is stuck, so we had to end up cutting the rope. It was definitely like stuck on something that felt like hard, like... Uh, I don't, I don't know if it was a rock, I don't know if it was wiring or cable or whatever, but anyways, we had to get rid of the anchor. So I'm gonna have to make a f trip to Field and Stream sometime and get us another anchor, that way we can really lock down when we're in the deeper water. But uh, yeah, we had to chop the anchor off. Now I'm back at the house. First impressions of these things, you've seen me use them a lot in previous videos. You know we love the Bonafide SS127 models, and these ones right here were actually sent to us courtesy of Bonafide, the one was. Um, I've been working hard actively tagging them and actually they sent the yellow venom color new for 2020 for free and then this one we got uh, at an influencer discount of 60% of MSRP is what we paid for this one. So all in all we spent about a thousand dollars on what would have easily costed well over three grand for these new bona fides. and if you're thinking about getting into a kayak these things are so stable it's ridiculous. So I've been fishing them in nothing but the highest wins <laughs> this last week and catching monster fish but definitely a ton of fun getting out on these things i got a few things we got to do still 
Uh, I've got to actually put together our seat that came with this one. These are two seats from the Guggen ones, so these are not brand new, but the seat that goes with this color right here is actually not that style. So we're gonna have a different style seat for the endless summer kayak soon. And then uh, that one right there, I just got to install the seat and then we're gonna end up returning both of those to the Guggen squad to go back on some yaks that they had there. Uh, but everything about these things is pretty dope. All I want to do in today's video is really cover first impressions essentially on the colors because I'm gonna do more of a full style review coming up very soon. So do be looking out for that. But just know these things are absolutely sick. If you're in the market for a kayak, definitely at least take a look at them. And that's all I could ask for. Now we're gonna take you inside and show you some of this apparel that we got as well as new baits that have just dropped. I'm pretty stoked. To finish up this evening's video, we're gonna show you all the new gear we just got from the warehouse as well as some new baits. And just know that you can pick up any of this stuff for 15% off using code Weston on the Guggen Squad uh, website or on the Guggen Squad application. So let's break this stuff out. Uh, first of all, we got this one right here. I believe this says Guggen Baits, Guggen Squad, or Guggen, or something along those lines, but I'm not 100% sure yet. So what does that say? Now. Could say Weston's an idiot. Ooh, yeah. Digging it. New Guggen Squad hooded UV protectant long sleeve Guggen Squad shirt right here. This is gonna get utilized very quickly. Then we got a Guggen Bates hoodie. We got Guggen Takeover. Join the Takeover. Another hooded sun shirt. Uh, this one has a pocket in the front. That's cool. Store some stuff. Okay. And then uh, Guggen Squad on the sleeve. Extra dope. Gonna be putting that to use very soon as well. This one I was pretty excited about. This isn't a hoodie. I'm pretty sure they offer this in a hoodie though because I believe I've seen Lunkers sport this in some of his videos. Maybe it was just my imagination and it was not hooded. But I'm pretty stoked on this right here. I grabbed this for Devin. Check this out. Yeah. Join the takeover, nice little hoodie. But the material is uh, is different. What is this? You know, so the last one is this like cotton polyester blend fleece. It's pretty sweet. And then check this out. We got some of the new smaller baits. I'm pretty psyched on all this. We got some little Kraken Craws. We got the June Bug color. We also got some Trench Hogs and Natural. This is probably the one I'm most excited about. Oh, wait, wait till I show you guys this. This is so cool. It's a 4.65 inch Trench Hog. Like this thing is gonna get destroyed. I literally cannot wait to throw this. That's gonna be fun. And then we got some green pumpkin cracking craws in that smaller size, three inch. And then I got some bandito bugs in blue baby. These are 3.3 inch bandito bugs. You guys will definitely see me throwing the cracking craw and the bandito bug smaller sizes here as jig trailers. I'm gonna try them out on a lot of jigs for sure. Definitely gonna maybe like Texas rig this guy right here though with like a two or three odd worm hook. That's going to be a ton of fun. All right, y'all, before we go, if you have any questions regarding the Bonafide kayaks, please ask them here, and I will be sure to include most of them in my actual review. I'm curious what you guys might want to know about them, uh, as opposed to what I would just put in the video myself and talk about, because I'm sure there's questions that might pop up that I wouldn't bring up otherwise, so please help me out on my full review of the Bonafide SS127 kayaks coming very soon, and I'll be sure to answer a lot of y'all's questions. With that said, I'm going to go ahead and get these baits put up and ready for use on some of the next future videos. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss them. Oh.